Stop. It's a sunny day in the school playground. And Buster and Scout are drawing together. Uh-oh. Looks like they both want the blue crayon. Buster snatches it. And now Scout is trying to snatch it back. It's given Buster and Bandit a great idea for a game they can all play together. <laughs> Using their imaginations. <laughs> it's cops and robbers. Buster and Bandit are the robbers. And Ash and Scout are the cops trying to catch them. Off they go. The chase is on. Buster and Bandit are splitting up. Oh no! Bandit is cornered! Aha! He's got a plan! Where has he gone? Hang on a second! That fox is moving! Quick, Ash! You can catch him! He's jumping off that ramp! Go, Buster! I wonder if Buster and Bandit are going to escape. They're all getting very close. Whoa, watch out! Buster and Bandit have driven straight into jail. Hooray for the cops, Scout, and Ash. Time to give up the crayon, Buster. <laughs> that was fantastic. What a brilliant game. Now Scout can finally finish off her drawing. Buster and Bandit are free to go. What a fantastic playtime, everyone! It's sports day at Buster's school. How exciting! First is the 100-meter sprint. On your marks, get set, go! Go, Buster! He's the winner! Hooray! That was easy! Buster is the fastest in school! Next up, it's the high jump! Scout's up first! Scoot, scoot! Wow! That was awesome! Buster thinks he can beat that jump! Off he goes! Oops! Don't worry, Buster! He doesn't look very happy! It's the egg and spoon race next. Get ready and go! Buster really wants to win. Whoops! Buster was going too fast and smashed the egg. Oh dear. And Ash is the winner. Well done, Ash. Buster is annoyed about losing. He really wanted to win. He's so upset that he isn't playing ball with the others. That does look fun, Buster. It's not just about winning, Buster. It's about having fun. Hooray! Now they're all having fun together. It's time to present the medals. Buster is third, Ash is second, and Scout is first. Well done, everyone. What a brilliant day. Buster is having so much fun playing on his drum kit. Oops, there goes a drumstick. It's rolling over to Mommy. Hmm, what's Mommy doing? Oh, she's clearing out all Buster's old toys. The ones he doesn't use anymore. I wonder what's inside. Look, Buster's baby drum. He remembers that. Mommy is going to recycle it so someone else can enjoy it. Buster is sad. But he has a bigger, better drum kit now. But Buster wants to keep his little drum. He doesn't like to let go. Here's Scout with her tambourine. She's come round to play. Hooray! Time to make some music. Buster and Scout are ready to play. And here's Ash, too. He's come to listen. Now Buster and Scout have an audience. They're ready to rock. One, two, three, four. 
Nice! Buster and Scout are really grooving! Nice work, guys! Scout shakes the tambourine. Buster bangs the drums. Oh, he's trying to play his little drum at the same time. That doesn't work so well. He's trying to do too much at once. Oops! Aw, Ash wants to join in. But he doesn't have an instrument. And Buster has one too many. What's he going to do? <laughs> Buster is giving his little drum to Ash to play. Now Ash can play along. And all three of them can have fun. Ready? One, two, three, four! There! That sounds even better than before! At the end of the day, Ash is going to give the drum back. But Buster knows he doesn't need two drums. He wants Ash to keep it. Ash is so happy! What a kind thing Buster did! Buster, Scout, Bandit, and Ash are having a race. Buster and Bandit are neck and neck. But Scout dashed into the lead. Whoosh! Scout won! Nice work, Scout. She really is super speedy. What's that noise? Thunder? Oh no, it's a storm! They should take cover or they'll get all wet. Whoa, that was close! Ash nearly skidded into his friends on the wet grass. Wait a minute, that gives Buster an idea. Whoosh! Skidding through those muddy puddles is great fun! They could play a game, see who can skid the furthest. What a great idea! Bandit is going first. Swish! He skidded all the way over there! But Scout thinks she can do better. Vroom! Whoa! Scout went even further than Bandit! Now it's Ash's turn! He's so little, he's spinning round and round! He's all dizzy, but he's gone the furthest yet! Last up, it's Buster! Whoosh! Uh-oh, he's getting out of control! Whoa! Oops! Buster splashed Mommy with mud! Looks like it's time for all the little vehicles to get back home. They're back at Buster's house in no time. But wait, they can't go inside until they're all cleaned up. Mommy's going to use the hose to wash all the mud off. Splish splash! And there, now all four of them are clean again. But even so, that skidding race was so much fun! Buster is so excited to go play with his best friend, Scout! What'll they play today? Ooh! Grandpa has a remote-controlled car! Buster is going to control it first! Vroom, vroom! Look at it go! <laughs> now Scout wants a go. But Buster wants to keep driving. Uh-oh, Scout doesn't think that's fair. <gasps> she wants a turn. Oh dear. Now they're fighting over the remote. They both want to control the toy car. Oh no! The car crashed and broke. Now nobody can play with it. Buster and Scout are upset with each other. They're not playing anymore. It's so sad when friends argue. But wait, I think Grandpa has an idea. He's giving the remote to Scout and the toy car to Buster. 
They'll need to work together to fix it. <laughs> Aw, oh, now they've made up. Oh. Friends always <laughs> forgive each other. <laughs> there! Now they can both control the car. Buster and Diggly are having so much fun playing with that remote-controlled car. Vroom, vroom! <laughs> Look at it go! Look, there's Mommy! She's coming to tell them lunch is ready. And she's reminding Buster to put his toys away. Buster is putting the controller away, but look, the car is still outside. Now Buster and Diggly are back to carry on playing. But, oh no! They can't see the toy car anywhere. Where could it be? Could it be in the toy box? No. Maybe it's in the dustbin. No. Maybe it's buried under the autumn leaves. It must be here somewhere. Wait, I think Buster has an idea. If they use the control, listen. The car's engine. Where's the noise coming from? Under that pile of leaves? Hooray! They found the toy car. But wait, now the controller is missing. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Well spotted, Buster. Now Diggly and Buster can have fun playing with their remote-controlled car again. But this time, they'll remember to put their toys back in the toy box when they're finished with them. Good job! It's the end of school, and it's time for Scout to return the school flower that she'd been taking care of. Now whose turn is it to take it home and care for it? Hooray! It's Buster's turn! Buster is going really slowly. He wants to make sure he takes good care of the flower. It's time to say goodbye to Scout and Ash. Whoa! Careful, Buster! That was a close one. Buster is so happy to be caring for the flower that he's drawn a picture of it. He's even brought it to dinner. <laughs> I don't think it eats carrots, Buster. It needs water instead to make sure it grows strong. But now it's time for bed. Good night, flower. The next morning, Buster is super excited for school. Careful, Buster, you don't want to knock the flower. Oh no! The flower has smashed. What is Buster doing? He's hiding it because he's afraid he'll get in trouble. Hmm, Buster is pretending to be ill. But he doesn't have a temperature. Oh, now Mommy understands. Buster doesn't want to go to school with the smashed flower. He thinks he's let everyone down. But Mommy knows what to do. They'll put the flower in a brand new pot. It looks even better than before. There, good as new. Buster returns the flower to class. Everyone is really impressed with its lovely new pot. Good job, Buster. Now it's Ash's turn to take care of it. Hooray! It's a bright, sunny day, and Buster wants to play outside. But what's this? He's left his toys all over the floor. Buster knows he should clean them up, but he really wants to go and play. Whoa! Buster's cleaning up all the toys super fast. But not very well. Oh dear, he's knocked that glass over. And now his mopping up has left water everywhere.
soon, Buster is outside playing. What was that? <gasps> Mommy slipped on all the water. Oh dear, the room is still such a mess. Buster feels really bad for not cleaning up well. But he can make it all better. He just has to clean up properly and take his time to do it right. Mommy and Buster can do it together, like it's a game. <laughs> Chores are so much easier to do when you find the fun in them. And they're so much faster if you work together. There, Buster is even cleaning up that drink he spilled. Perfect! The room is all tidy at last. Now Buster and Mommy can go and play ball together. Hooray! It's evening time, and Buster's cousin Bandit is coming for a sleepover. This is going to be so much fun! First, it's time for a snack. I wonder what it will be. Oh, wow! Cookies! They look so tasty! Buster and Bandit love cookies. There, one each. <laughs> Yummy. Now Mommy's put them away. But Bandit knows where they are. Bandit and Buster have such a fun evening playing together. But then it's time for bed. They want to stay up longer. But Mommy says no. Hmm, I think Bandit has an idea. I wonder what he's whispering. Now, everyone's fast asleep. But what's this? Bandit's waking up. Buster too! They're sneaking back downstairs. Oh, Bandit is going to steal some more cookies. That's very naughty. Oops, that made a loud noise. Mommy's caught them. She's very disappointed in Buster and Bandit. The two little buses are very sorry. They'll go back to bed now as they're told. But the next morning, Buster and Bandit have surprised Mommy by making breakfast. They wanted to show how sorry they were. Buster is so excited to go play with his best friend, Scout. What'll they play today? Ooh, Grandpa has a remote-controlled car! Buster's going to control it first. Vroom, vroom! Look at it go! Now Scout wants a go. But Buster wants to keep driving. Uh-oh, Scout doesn't think that's fair. She wants a turn. Oh dear. Now they're fighting over the remote. They both want to control the toy car. Oh no! The car crashed and broke! <gasps> now nobody can play with it. Buster and Scout are upset with each other. They're not playing anymore. It's so sad when friends argue. But wait, I think Grandpa has an idea. Ah. <gasps> 
<laughs> He's giving the remote to Scout and the toy car to Buster. They'll need to work together to fix it. <laughs> Aw, oh, now they've made up. Oh. Friends always forgive each other. <laughs> there! Now they can both control the car. It's time for Buster to go to school. He mustn't forget his packed lunch. There's Scout. They don't want to be late. But who's this? A little fire truck? Buster is waving hello. At school, the teacher has a surprise. This is Ash. He's the new kid in school. He's going to be joining their class. Ash is going to Buster because he waved hello. He's so excited to have made a new friend already. Now today, the children are going to learn about parking. The teacher is showing them how to do it properly. Now it's their turn to try. Scout's got it. And Buster. Oh. Ash is sticking really close to his new friend. He's following Buster wherever he goes. He doesn't understand Buster is trying to park. Oh dear. I think he's got on Buster's nerves a bit. Buster wanted some space, but Ash didn't understand. At break time, Buster and Scout are playing. Aw, poor Ash has no friends to play with. But Buster and Scout have an idea. Ash can play with them. They're friends now after all. Now they're all playing together. Whoa, good shot, Ash! It's so nice to make new friends. There's Buster and Scout driving home. Wait, what was that? Oh, wow! It's a little baby reindeer. She must be lost. Buster is trying to cheer her up. Aw, I think she wants to play. <laughs> She's a jumpy little girl. Now Buster's throwing a snowball. Oops, <laughs> sorry, Scout. It's fun to play with new friends. Now Buster has built a snow ramp. I wonder what he's up to. Vroom! Buster's doing a big jump. Now it's the baby reindeer's turn. Whoosh! <laughs> now Scout! Oh. Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Buster. <gasps> but where's the baby reindeer gone? They're following the footprints. There! <laughs> she was playing hide and seek. <gasps> Where's Scout going? A big pile of snow. Oh, look! It's Scout! Whoa! More reindeer footprints. Bigger ones. I wonder where they lead. I think the friends are going to follow them. The tracks are winding all through the trees. Look! It's Mommy and Daddy reindeer! They're so happy they found Baby. Baby Reindeer has had so much fun playing with Buster and Scout. But now it's time to say goodbye. Bye, Baby Reindeer. See you again soon. Buster and Grandpa are visiting the Christmas Winter Wonderland. Look at all the amazing stalls. Wow, Buster really wants to win that teddy bear. He's asking Grandpa if they can play. They get three throws to knock down the cans. Oops, Buster missed. 
<laughs> oh dear, that's all three of his throws. He's having another go. Oh no, he missed again. Buster's upset. But I think Grandpa can teach Buster a thing or two about throwing. The key to hitting what you aim at is to take your time. First, you take a big, long breath. Then take aim, crouch low, and throw. Whoa! Grandpa hit the cans! Now it's Buster's turn. A big, long breath. Take aim, crouch low, and throw! Hooray! <laughs> nice shot, Buster! Now, time to go win that teddy bear! Oh dear! Buster didn't take his time. He needs to take a big, long breath, take aim, crouch low, and throw! Hooray! Buster did it! Well done, Buster! And here's his prize! Buster's so proud of himself! Oh, whoa! It's time for the Christmas talent show! Bandit is going first. He's doing some magic tricks. Good job, Bandit! Aw, Buster looks nervous. I think he's got a bit of stage fright. Poor Buster. There's Scout. It's her turn next. She looks so excited. Oh, cool. She's going to do some juggling. Very good, Scout. Oh, dear. Buster still looks nervous. He's afraid to go on stage in front of all those people. Hooray! Scout's finished her show. Now it's Buster's turn. Aw, but Buster doesn't want to go on stage. Mommy's getting worried about Buster. The stage is empty. I think Mommy has an idea. What's this? Mommy's on stage. She's encouraging Buster to come join her. They'll do it together. Here Buster comes. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Good tidings we bring, with Buster we sing. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Merry Christmas! Oh, well done, Buster and Mommy. That was beautiful. It's a brand new snowy day. And Buster can't wait to go outside and play. It's so much fun to play in the snow. And the best game of all is a snowball fight. Diggly and Scout are on one team, but Buster needs a teammate. Look, there's Bandit. He can be on Buster's team. Though Buster and Bandit don't always get along. Time to start throwing snowballs. Buster and Bandit are hiding behind that hill. Hmm. Buster thinks they should go this way. But Bandit thinks they should go that way. Oh dear, they can't agree. They're not working together as a team. Buster is sneaking through the trees. But Scout has spotted him. Look out! Oh dear. Bandit is trying to sneak behind the fence. Buster and Bandit aren't doing very well. But look! Scout and Diggly are working together. That's it! 
If Buster and Bandit want to win, they'll need to work together like a team. <laughs> Whoosh! Off they go! <laughs> That's more like it! Now it's a real fun snowball fight! It's much better with teamwork! <laughs> Who threw that snowball? <gasps> Grandpa! The more players, the more fun it is! 